Hey guys, what's up? My name is Ronan Vico and in this video we're going to talk about the recent announcement from Microsoft, the end of AI Builder credits. So basically starting November 1st of 2025, the AI Builder features in Power Automate and Power Apps will also be licensed based on compiled credit. Basically, instead of having AI Builder credits for Power Apps and Automate and Copilot credit for Copilot Studio, Microsoft just combined both of them. But what does this mean to us? What is the future and how this affect you? First thing that you need to understand is that instead of having like two coins to exchange into AI features, we now have just one credit, that is, that is the Copilot credit. That's a good thing, that simplified a lot to us. With that in mind, now to develop Power Automate and Power Apps prompts or models, you do not need credits anymore. With that, the AI Builder trial is not available anymore. Let's talk more about it. Basically, now what we have, it's a free use of prompts and models as a maker. So instead of asking for this AI Builder free trial to test the prompts and models, if you are a maker, it's free to use. That's really good because nowadays and in the past, I, I'm recording this video in October of 2025, you need to have a, a free trial of AI Builder as a developer to test prompts, to train models, and then use at production. And sometimes you need to extend the trial. So instead of asking for trials and asking for extensions, you do not have AI Builder trials anymore. You do not have the effort to ask for trial or extensions. You have for free. That's really good. So if you are a maker on Power Platform, you have access to the AI hub on the Power Platform like I have here. Basically, it's this page and other pages about the AI. You can use the prompts and models for free to develop and test, okay? That's, that's important. So pay attention here. To develop and test, if you are a maker, it will be free after November 1st. Because of that, that's why this is highlighted here. The access to prompt and models and also the model training are free now. Other cool thing is that some of the models, there are two listed right now, but I don't know if in the future we'll have more. Binary classification and the business card models are now free. So if you have um, Power Apps, and a Power Automate that use one of them or both of them will not expand your credits. That's pretty good. But I do not know if it's required to have Automate or Ads Premium to use them. What I know and is highlighted right here is that will not expand your credits. So if you have like a Power Apps Premium and you are using them, will not expand credits. It's free to use but I think that will be required to have the premium. I think, I do, I'm not sure about it, but I think that you, you need the premium, but will not expand credits. Okay, Rona, but I have a lot of AI Builder credits. How about now? In November, uh, I have like a pack that I, I bought on the past. I have like 200,000 of AI Builder credits on, on my add-on that I, I bought. Basically, you will have access to consume all of this AI Builder credit first and then fall back to Copilot credit. So don't worry about it. You will expand what you bought and now uh, in the future, you will need your Copilot credit specs. So basically, instead of having the AI Builder credits add-ons, also the AI Builder that you have when you buy the Power Apps Premium or the Power Automate Premium, you will have the Copilot credit packs. The Copilot credit rate card and the consuming on each AI Builder model is based on the length of the characters, the tokens, and also the feature that you are using. The more you use it, 
the more you pay. To basic stuff like text recognition, analysis of sentiment, language detection, create phrases extraction for 1,000 tokens, or you can understand it as 1,000 characters, cost only 0 0.1 copilot credit. So I think that is pretty cheap for basic stuff, right? And of course, if you need uh, like standard operations or premium, it will cost more. That's how AI works. You already know that if you use OpenAI, Gemini, or any other AI models that need to pay by the use, you know that the more feature that you use, the more you expand, the more you pay, right? In the, the specific case of custom document processing, to read PDF, read documents, the, the processing will cost eight copilot credit. That changes a lot, but I will not focus on this topic. Let's move on. You are able to plan the upcoming months. The pricing of the copilot credit is based on two types, the prepaid packs and the pay-as-you-go. So it's the same as the Copilot Studio license, right? You can pay-as-you-go or you can buy a pack with some of credits and consume that on the month. But in the other month, it will be renewed. So you, you lose what you don't expand, right? So here you need to, to plan what you're going to use and decide by yourself what is the best option here for your company. And what wasn't clear for me about the topic of the, the cost and the management of the credit is, I know that binary classification and business card models are free. Maybe other prompts are free too. Let's check in the next month. But some prompts and custom models will consume credits, right? So if I have a Power Apps Premium and I need to use like um, custom document processing or uh, text translation, I will consume credits, right? Because consume by tokens here. In Nowadays, if I go to Power Apps Pricing or Power Automate Pricing, both of them, right? When I buy a Power Apps Premium, I do have some amount of AI Builder credits, 500 here. I, I don't find the information if, when I buy the Power Apps Premium in the future, or if I buy a Power Automate Premium in the future, will I have Copilot credits included? I don't know. If not, I won't be happy about it because I know that I have some models that are free now, but we know that we need the custom ones and the best will be the custom ones. Over time, we'll sit and be able to draw a better conclusion about it, right? Hope you guys enjoy it this video i will leave the link of the doc in the description so you can read more about it and understand more about this topic thank you so much for watching hit the thumbs up leave your feedback down below and write on your feedback the word orange so leave your feedback and write the word orange so i will know that you watched the video completed also if you want to learn more about power platform and microsoft tools you can click on the first link on the description and have access to the best courses with a huge discount using my coupon code. Share this channel so we can grow up and bring more free content like this to you. See you in another video in another class and please consider to subscribe.